everybody, my name is Madison here at the Mission Bend Branch Library, and today we're going to be learning how to make our own potpourri. The supplies you'll be needing for today are a bag of pine cones, some aluminum foil, some whole cloves, cinnamon sticks, whole star anise, some orange peels, a mason jar, and a toaster oven. Let's get started. So let's start making our potpourri. First, you'll get the little pan out of the toaster oven. This is where the tin foil will come in, so you can just take it out of the box a little bit and just rip it. It has the blades on it, ready to go. And we'll put it nicely so on top of the pan. Next, we'll get what we're gonna be using for the potpourri today. We'll just open our bags. You can add a lot or a little. Make sure your hands are washed first beforehand. So we'll add some of the clove. We'll add two pine cones. Next, we can add our cinnamon sticks. We'll add three of them. Now we can add some of the star anise. And then we'll add a little bit of the orange peel. Now we can put it in the toaster oven. You can bake it for as long as you want, but for purposes of this video, we'll do it for 10 minutes. So check back with us in 10 minutes and we'll proceed to the next step. Okay, welcome back. It's been 10 minutes with the toaster oven. Our stuff has heated up and the aroma is kicking in. So now what we'll do with this plastic spoon, it still may be a little hot, so be gentle. We'll put everything we've used in the toaster oven into this mason jar. And it's great to give to us as a gift as well to loved ones. I don't think we'll be able to get all of the clove in with it being hot, the pan being hot. So we'll just scoop a little bit of it. Get the orange peel in there. And it's great with potpourris. They can be made any time of the year. So it doesn't have to be cinnamon or orange you put in the mason jar. You can even make potpourri with water. So it can be dry or a liquid potpourri. And this is great to put in the kitchen, the bathroom, the bedroom, the living room, anywhere, and the aroma will just fill up the, the place very well. And that is it. Thank you for coming to our homemade potpourri program. I hope you enjoyed it, and I hope to see you again very soon.